This is Ganchi Santelis, Elder Ganchi Santelis. I met Ganchi the first time when he was seven years old. He had been through the devastating Haitian earthquake when he was five. And I told a, a beautiful story about him in a general conference about his apartment was totally smashed. They thought no one was living. And then as your father walked around, he heard the voice of someone singing. And Ganshi was singing, I am a child of God. And that told people he was alive. And they dug and dug. Uh, he, it did require him to amputate his arm, but he came out 100%. <laughs> I know you were too young at that point, but as you thought about it, Elder Santos, how did that experience make you feel about your life? The experience helped me feel that, that God was the one who saved me that night, that it doesn't just come to a five-year-old's head to start singing a hymn or a primary song, and that through that song, through God's inspiration to me, that I was saved that night. Does that make you feel like there's a purpose in your life? that you're to live? It does. <laughs> now here you are, a missionary, learning Spanish, going to uh, the Florida Tampa Mission. I'll be teaching how the Savior can, can benefit the lives of everyone. And I know he's benefited my life and, and how we can become disciples and be a true conversion to the Lord. I'm very proud of you. When I spoke about you in general conference in April of 2012, I didn't know if I'd ever see you as a man going on a mission. <laughs> but I'm very happy and I, I hope you'll be my friend through, through the rest of your life, or I should say through the rest of my life, because my life will end before yours. Will you do that? Okay. I love you. I'll give you a hug. Thank you.